Hi guys, it's Christina Connolly with another tech tip for you today. I'm here on Google Slides and I'm going to show you how you can use a new feature called the eyedropper to custom select colors to match with graphics or other items you have on your page. So let me show you how this works. I've selected my theme for my slides by going to the theme button and I clicked on the one that I wanted. However, while I like this layout, I might not like the colors. So I want to try to match the color of my slide to this graphic I have put on the slide up here. I want to change the background by making sure to click on the slide and going to the background button. I'll come in here to the background color and you'll see now in the custom range, you'll find a little eyedropper that says to pick a custom color. I'm going to click the eyedropper which now allows me to scroll over parts of my screen to choose which color I want to match. So maybe I like this red that I see up here. I'll click there and you'll see that my slide background does change. So I'm going to click done. And now I'm matching my slides to go with the graphics that I have on my page. This works for your font as well. So if I scroll over the words that I want to change and I come up to change the color, I'll see the eyedropper here and I can choose what color I want these words to be by scrolling over different parts of the image until I get it where I want. And maybe I like that yellow and you'll see that my words have changed as well. This works for shapes. So let's say I wanna put a different shape on my screen and I wanna change the color. I'll come to the bucket, find the eyedropper and select the color I want. I've really customized this first slide to be what I want, but what happens when I go to add a new slide well, it defaults to the old design. Let me undo that. Click on my slide and go to background. And I'm going to add this to the theme so that now when I click for a new slide, my slide is matching in color and I could then adjust the layout to whatever kind of slide I would like. If you have questions about how to use the eyedropper in Google Slides, just let me know. Thanks and have a great day.